Where are you guys from? Probably from uh, Africa. Africa? Mm -hmm. Burundi, Central Africa. Burundi. Burundi. Yeah. Central Africa. Yeah. And me, I'm from Congo. From Congo? From Congo. Yeah. Uh, how long have you been here? Uh, 20 months. Really? Yeah. yeah, really. How did you come here? I was in my country and the war started. I fled to Kenya and I was in a refugee camp for nine years in Kenya. And oh, really? then I get a humanitarian visa to come to Australia. Really? Yeah. Wow. That's amazing. The Masudi family did not come by boat. They are among the lucky ones. Just 1% of the world's refugees are resettled through official channels by the UN. It's sort of mind-boggling to think that with two young children you had to flee. After fleeing their war-torn homelands, Bahati and Masara first sought refuge in Kenya. Yes. To refugee camp is somewhere here near to Sudan. But they soon discovered the UN refugee camp was no safe haven. UN said gave you the food. Oh, the local nice. people also, they came at night with the gun. Yeah, and then right. when you see the gun, you give them the food and you say like that with your family. Save your life. Yeah. Local, local, local people? Yeah, local. local people? Yeah. Really? Yeah. And they steal your food? Yeah. 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 You are going to see the doctor. When the doctor finished to do the checkup, tell you go and buy Panadol, something, something, something like that. And you say, I don't have money. You say, hey, if you don't have money, what do you, do you want me to do? And then I lost my baby like that because I don't have money. I don't have something. It's dying. Before Felix, I have a small daughter. Yeah. It's dying, yeah. yeah. You seem to have went through a lot while you were over in your, the country. One day my son asked he said, if he, someone can come to kill her because he, he don't, he don't uh, have a hope to, to live again. I am so, saying, God, even you kill me now yeah. because I'm suffering a lot. Uh, it's not a very happy story. In Burundi, Bahati was vice president of a political party, just like Roderick is in Australia. Not very, not in very many places. Tony Abbott. Yeah, that's right. It's good to be involved in politics. I think it's important to. It's good to be involved in politics, like, like in Australia, but not in Africa. Not in Africa. It's not a good thing. Yeah, it's not a good thing. Something. <laughs> Three hundred and twenty people in my group was killed. Who killed them? The government. The, and why did they? because you were on the other side yeah, to the government. Yeah. It took me in the prison for six months and give a torture for ev everywhere. I have the wound here, here, everywhere. And they, they tortured you they then? They tortured me, yeah, more, more. I, have, I also have the wound here, here, and the leg and the face everywhere. It took them to the hospital. I stayed in the hospital for two weeks. Mm. What, what did they... Do you feel comfortable talking about what they did, or...? Oh, it's not comfortable. It's not difficult? Or? It's not comfortable. It's, it's not, not comfortable? Difficult. Yeah. And then when they come, they come to look after me, yeah. I was a runaway in 2000. And that was, that leads into, that's why you fled, because... Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's yeah. why you fled. Something else. <laughs> yeah. When you've sort of made your career here, would you ever consider like, going back to try and help or <laughs> looking at it? Because you... you still got sort of I, history I, there. I, I don't have that you feeling just, because... Uh, you just want to leave I, it. I've grown up um, outside of my country for yeah. a long time. Yeah. And they have a bad souvenir. Yeah. So happy not to go back and... Yeah. It's only after three days together that Masara is comfortable revealing her tortured memories of the Congo. It was a long time ago. We finished the second dinner. Mm -hmm. All the family. Mm -hmm. And then we start to hear the... Grenade. 
Oh, 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 something like that. They broke the door. They took my father, my brother. Yeah. They start to beat my mother, something like that. Yeah. Two sisters is 12. Yeah. Another one, she, she was eight years. They took them. No. Yeah. And they, that time, they raped them. Was your sisters 12 and 8 when they got raped by these people? Yeah. They were that young? Yeah. Mm -hmm. One and a half eggs since that time. Yeah. Yeah. From being raped. Mm -hmm. oh, that's terrible. Yes. When they finish raping them, we collect them, we, take, we go to Burundi yeah. and we decide we are not going anywhere again. Then I meet Bahati in Burundi. And said that marriage with Bahati. So if you say you are going this place, you can get peace. There is no peace. And when we say, is it only Australia? When I came here, I never hear the, the gun. Yeah, gunfire. Yeah. yeah. Is it hard for you to talk to us like this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're a lovely lady and you don't deserve it. You didn't deserve what you went through. You alright? Yeah. Only four of Masara's seven siblings survived the war. One sister has been in a Kenyan refugee camp for four years. To save my children also is good for me. Mm -hmm. I'm happy. Because my children, they came here and they going to school, especially that time. But I still remember my family. Yes. Because I have yes. my family. Yeah. Mm. I know the situation they are now is yeah. not a good situation. No. Mm. Who yeah. took care of them? You can see their eyes thinking, what the hell are they doing here? You know, why are they in this line? It's uh, very intimidating. 